Hello, I am Sri from CBTU. Welcome to the Ethical Hacker Training Course based on CEH Certification Program by EC Council. Module Malware, Virus and Worms Section Introduction to Virus A computer virus is malicious software program also called as malware that when executed replicates itself by modifying other programs and inserting its own code. Virus can infect programs, data files, or the boot sector of the hard drive and use anti-detection steel strategies to avoid antivirus software. Virus writers use social engineering tricks to exploit security vulnerabilities to spread and infect systems. Malware includes virus, worms, spyware, ransomware, adware, trojan horses, keyloggers, rootkits, bootkits, malicious browser help objects, BHOs, and any other malicious software. The term virus is coined originally by Fred Cohen in 1985. Most virus spread on the removable media such as USB drives and with the network. Viruses can infect the files and spread when it is accessed by other computers in the network. Normal mode of virus spreading is through email attachments, documents and media files and software, app downloads which are tweaked and embedded with the virus. Macro viruses are written in the scripting language for the Microsoft Word and Excel and spread throughout Microsoft Office by infecting documents and spreadsheets. The virus take advantage of the Microsoft Outlook com component object model interface for sending emails. A virus may also send a web address link as an instant message to all the contacts stored on the infected machine. The recipient mostly thinks that it is from a trusted source, a friend, and follows the link to a website and gets infected. Motives for creating a virus can include seeking profit, Example is ransomware. Desire to send a political message, personal amusement, to demonstrate that a vulnerability exists in a software, for sabotage, denial of service, or explore cybersecurity issues, etc. Security researchers are actively searching for new ways to enable antivirus solutions to more effectively detect emerging virus before they have already become widely distributed. Computer viruses cause billions of dollars worth of economic damage each year due to causing system failure, wasting computer resources, corrupting data, increasing maintenance costs, etc. A software is often designed with security features to prevent unauthorized use of system resources. Software development strategies that produce large number of bugs will generally also produce potential exploitable holes entrances for the virus. Many virus exploit and manipulate security bugs, defects. Any companies releasing a software or software update will try to fix all the security bugs so that the software doesn't cause harm and serve its purpose. The vast majority of the virus target Microsoft Windows due to its larger market share. Open source operating systems such as Linux allow users to choose from a variety of desktop environments packaging tools, etc. Which means that a malicious code targeting any of these systems will only affect a subset of all users. Windows users run the same set of applications enabling viruses to rapidly spread among the Microsoft Windows systems by targeting the same exploits in the large number of hosts. Windows users mostly use admin account for operation, while Linux users generally do not log in with root account for regular operation. This limits the harm possibilities of a virus even if it's trying. Ransomware is a malware virus that hacks a user's system, encrypts the user's system and posts a message on the user's screen saying that the screen or the system will remain locked or unusable until a ransom payment is made. Ransomware and phishing scam alerts appear as press releases on the Internet Crime Complaint Center IC3.gov notice board. This is the web page of IC3.gov. Phishing is a deception in which malicious individual pretends to be a friend, computer security expert, or other benevolent individual 
with the goal of convincing the targeted individual to reveal passwords or other personal information. Phishing is an email or a phone that appears to have come from a bank and convince you to provide personal information. Virus is a malicious software which can replicate itself with human intervention. Worm is like a virus which replicates and spreads itself without any human intervention. Trojan Horse is a malicious program that appears harmless. Trojans do not propagate themselves like virus and worms. Thanks for watching.